All right, everyone. Uh, we have started. We've got our nemesis against Hold My Beer. Uh, these are the first games. Uh, Malcolm Hook did a terrible rack on himself on table two. And table one's got a really nice layout here. We'll see what they're going to do. Uh, I am talking. Uh, we had another visitor pop in uh we're talking to them and then we will be back with y'all fully but just uh, give me a little bit but the matches are going live now these are our first two it is a race of 13. So I'll be right back with you. All right, everybody, I am back. My pool wife showed up, which she runs the, uh, she's not league operator for the APA of San Antonio. She is, she pretty much runs it, does all the paperwork, everything. So Lisa and I were talking to her. Janet did already take off to Dallas. She surprised us. When Stacy and Janet popped in, you should have seen the look on Lisa's face. She turned around and I'm like, oh my, <laughs> almost fell out of her chair. All right, but these are the first two matches up for the, uh, what round are we on? This is the fourth place match. Winner of this will get, oh, I'm sorry, the loser of this will get fourth place. And the fourth place team gets twelve hundred dollars. Uh let me go ahead and go through the payouts. We're down to four teams, so I'll just go over four teams. 
first is 3,073, second is 2,300, third is 1,700, and fourth is 1,200. This is an in-house league here at Fast Eddie's Embassy Oak. The league operator is the gentleman shooting on table one right now, Eric. He runs it. Total payouts was $16,650. Uh, they pay out four places for standings at the end of the thing. That was 500 400 300 and 200 for the teams. Then they pay out individual prizes, and they do also break and runs. Individual prizes were 715 total. Break and run prizes was 1512. Good payout. Yeah, very good. Uh, like I said, just the payout for this tournament alone is over 13000 I got third place all the way around. You got third in break and run. You got third overall And third shooter. in teams. And third in teams. Nice. Mm -hmm. Well, hopefully you can do better since this is the fourth place round. Yeah, you just yeah. keep going. Nah, if, if we win this game, we're we're going all the way. Yeah, we're we're gonna at least make it to the finals. I mean, after that, I mean, that's a tough team. So right, Hammerheads is a mm. tough team, especially the double dip. Yes, exactly. But I think if we beat them the first set, they're gonna get frustrated, and then we'll we'll beat them the second set. Okay. Hey, Jacob, how you doing? Hey, Gerard. And then plus, we've been playing. For six hours, y'all have the advantage. Y'all have been playing, yeah. yeah. And see, that's what I one thing I didn't understand about the him coming in the finals mm -hmm. at seven. Yeah, it's like you're going to go up against players that have been playing exactly. all day long. And uh, what they should have done is instead of playing that match last night, they should have played that match today at like three o'clock. Yeah, and so they would have some game like that. That game in, yeah, but least. that would have pushed everything. I mean, we're already last. The final first set is scheduled at seven. Well, yeah, but... Unless uh, they bring it early on Sunday. Well, because we, we, we were supposed to start at 2, and if if we started at 2, then we would have to play at, what, 4.30? Yeah. And then if we won that, we play at the finals at 7. But if they came in and played at this time, right? then they would at least get some games in. Which I think that's what they should have done. But. Yeah, well, I know Eric's been looking at it, and I think I heard something about maybe a break next time too between like the second and third rounds or something okay. like that you okay. know so people can eat and yeah exactly like that. no that, that, that's one thing that i really didn't get any chance to do is to eat at all yesterday so uh yeah, I, I, I think the most break we had was like 30 minutes before. yeah because i mean un, you know fast eddies <laughs> does have food but unfortunately it's all fried yeah or, exactly you know, no, it's heavier it. food uh, i mean luckily they have wing stop right right down the way right here exactly so, uh, i'd rather much rather have that than their food here Jacob Pena crushing all those Fargo rated tournaments. <laughs> Doing decent. Hey, did you play the, the monthly yesterday at Betsy's, Jacob? I know Laz and uh, Justin split it from what I saw on Facebook. Oh, like, oh, Justin Espinosa. Yeah, Justin Espinosa. Uh, I thought you were talking about Justin Pena. I was like, no, no. Yeah, I was like, he just came out of retirement. He's already winning tournaments. Yeah. <laughs> Now, Justin Espinosa, he made a comment that he's actually starting to feel the groove. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's got the real job now. Yeah, he's, he does. he's got less stress on mm -hmm. him. I mean, trying to make a living as a pool player is it's really tough. It's really tough. That's, and, that's why I haven't done it. Yeah, baby. Get whatever you want. Uber. Eats. Or whatever option. Other I'm food. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Bring food in. Yeah. Whatever you want, I'll find something on the menu. Uh, we are easy to please. Yes. We're guys. Whatever yeah. you want, we can find something. Problem is, she's indecisive. Mm -hmm. exactly. Hey, you showed up. Can't win them all, Justin. Or Jacob. Uh, so you, uh. Oh, that, that, you got that, that, fifth, yeah, that's not bad. See, that's, that's, not, bad. that's not bad at all. In a still made split it in the, the, the money either way, tournament and Calcutta. So I mean, it's not too bad. But being a split the split bracket, you probably went high in the Calcutta, so that's 
the chat room. Yeah, I, I know what I'm gonna eat as soon as I get out of here. I'm gonna go to Firehouse Sub. I don't know if you like that or not. I do. I do. I love fire. Their their cherry limeade is actually mm -hmm. interesting. It's I like it. I don't it's think I've, different. I, I don't think I've had it. It's in the big red Coke box. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Huh. It's in there. It's their blend. If that's what you want. Yes. Oh, how was the sandwich place yesterday? Didn't y'all go to the sandwich no, place? No, we ended up doing Chinese. Oh, we okay. grabbed Beijing on the way home. Nice, nice. Okay. Oh. Yeah, so I ended up eating hers. Because mm -hmm. I wanted spicy, mm -hmm. but the general chicken that I ordered yeah. wasn't spicy. Oh, wow. But the, her pad thai was spicy. Okay. And then, so I ended up eating her pad thai, and mm, she ate my chicken. Well, if my brother doesn't mind eating Chinese, I think we're going to be going to a friend's house after this. And he lives off of, like, Kim Kimber Hill or something like that. Yeah. Uh, you know, I've been on Kappa Calibra. You know, Calibra, where it turns out the H-E-B. He, he lives back in that neighborhood back there. Oh, okay. So if we're going to be off of Calibra anyway, there's a spot next to Fast Eddie's over there that uh, really good Chinese food. And I, I would want to go over there. Okay. Haven't eaten there before. I think it's called Asia Kitchen. Really good. Okay. I've said they've been there since I was like twelve years old. Write that down, baby. I, I, I'll give you the info okay. here in a little bit. I'll actually look it up. Yeah, if you get there early, like I mean, you get more food when you take it to go. Oh, yeah? But, I mean, it's still really good. It's still filling either way. The Asia Chinese cuisine. It looks like that. It's it's like in a corner. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. So if you exit uh, 410, like you're going to Fast Cities, you know where the old Rocky J's was? No? Okay. Um, you go past Fast Cities, and then uh, <laughs> do you know where the CBS is? Right there on the corner or Walgreens or whatever yeah. it is. It's right across the street from there. It's like, but it's before you get there. It's not right there. Right. Oh, but it, it is fantastic. Y'all play out of there on Tuesdays? Well, so are you. Oh, yeah, yeah. The Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do that. Oh, the little test session? No, I, I go out of town for work on the 8th, and it starts on the 9th. So, yeah. Uh, I'll probably be gone for at least three months. Well, see, Lisa, Lisa's going to be doing the – she'll be okay. gone two of the four weeks. She'll mm -hmm. be gone. Yeah, I've had plenty of people ask me if uh, if we can make a team together. Yes, I've and seen on I Facebook. Just, I, just, I, I just can't do it. I mean, I, I'm always up for promoting leagues and everything. So Yeah, and that one's actually going to be original. It means something yes. new. Exactly. And I like the time limiting thing. Oh, because so do I. I mean, to, to just look at this match that yeah. just happened. I mean, we were we got done with ours and they needed three games and it took an hour and a half. Oh, nice try. Don't block it. I wonder what Jim's going to try to do. I think he might, I think it's a 12 ball. I think he might hit that and try to play it safe behind the net. 
But, I mean, the, the shot I'm seeing right now is if he hits the cue ball to the 13 and just replaces the 13 with the cue ball, yeah. he hooks on both ways. He, he has a jump shot for the, the four ball, right? but, but it's not going to give him much of shape for the six ball. So, oh, okay. I mean, I, I'd take that chance if it was. That is sweet. Uh, it, one Janet showed up here just surprised the hell out of Lisa. Oh yeah, but so, so, a, I mean, and for her to tell us, it. and for her us to come tell us that Floresville is most likely going to be so where the next, the next year. Uh, yeah, I, I am excited for that. That one's like yeah, that's, that's wow, twenty we, minutes from my house. Yeah, exactly. We, we, we don't have to travel very. I think it's like forty minutes away from my house. Don't have to do hotels. It's exactly. Like, I know. I can just drive home, sleep in my own bed. You know how great that is. Yep. <laughs> I can basically leave whenever I want. Yeah. Hopefully it'll be a good turnout, too. Floresville's got plenty of hotels. They've got, what, three major hotels? Yeah, they're all right there next, uh, to, right the, next to the convention. The Holiday too. Inn. Oh, good shot, Malcolm. Malcolm won the first Okay, game. so yeah. our nemesis gets on the board first. Yep. That was a long game. Yeah, it was. Because they started way before Table 1 did. Good shot, Malcolm. All right, everyone, this is a race to 13, just like you would play if you went to Vegas. Or state. Or state. Missed. All right, let's come. Let's go, Jim. Now, next year, BCA is actually bringing state back to Texas. Yes. So uh, For uh, CSI. For CSI. Yes. You know, since Bad Boys uh, is no longer involved with it. Yes, but Bad Boys is also doing their own thing. They're doing their own yes, thing. So, yes, but they're, they're going to have it at the Mayborn Center. But I don't like the uh, the way that they're doing it, though. Because, like, within, like, they, I think they do singles, yeah. like eight ball and nine ball, then scotch, and then teams. It's going to be over ten days they're running just it, for that. They're running it like it's a major Vegas. Yeah, exactly. It's like there's nationals. no need for that. There's no need for that. I mean, I can't take that much time off of work. So, yeah. I mean, like. I usually like to do the singles, and I, just, I can't do it. Uh, I have to go just for the teams, and that's it. Right. So they, they're actually losing out on a lot of players just because of that fact right there. Yeah, but the, I guess they're talking about they're just trying to bring the ones they can. Yes, exactly. I mean, that's, a, that's what it comes down to. Yeah, I got a little bit. Take, off, the, take a week don't, off. Don't, don't think at all about pool. And then. Well, well, well see, the, 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 that's what I did for a while. And I was playing, playing. I was in the slump. I couldn't get out of the slump. I took a week off. I came back like. So, I mean, we might still have to do that. Think about anything but. I think it'll be all right. Just kidnap her and take her somewhere. For a week. Yeah, exactly. You Just get away from it. Go, go out to the cabin. Or... Well, the thing is, is what you could do is just take the week off and then come back and play and just see how where you are. Yeah. It's never a bad thing to take a break. No, it really it's is. It's not. So, uh, I remember I, I took a break for a year and a half, and I, I didn't – I maybe played pool, I don't know, three times in the year and a half. Mm-hmm. And when I came back, that's when I played Vegas. That's when that's the year I won. And I just I couldn't miss a ball. Like I I, I played fantastic. So I mean, like I said, those breaks really do help. Because I mean, you, you get burnt out if you keep on playing. Exactly. I know. Yeah, yeah. You're you're in the same boat as me, man. Yeah, He can see this. Yeah, he, he's got a little angle, too, so he can just put straight top on it, and then once he makes it, it's going to go off the rail. And, oh, he's thinking about going the other way with it. I don't like that. 
If he can just put straight top, maybe a little bit of right hand English on this, then he can go on the opposite ball of, uh, of the eight where he's at right now. Yeah. And shoot it in the right corner. That's if he can see it. I think he can see it. But I think he can. I mean, we, we we got a funky angle for the camera yeah. because of where we are. But no, that's fine. But yeah, it's it's still you can still see the angles and stuff pretty fairly right. really good. Like Jim, Jim used to play back in the day. I don't know if uh, if you were here back then. I don't no. think you were. Um, it was even before my time. Oh, yeah, he tried to go the outside with it. Uh, I don't think that was the right shot. Um, but but yeah, he, apparently he. He he played back in the day and he shot like my speed like he shot really yeah. well, and uh, he took a bit a long break and came back and he's starting to get back into it now. Nice, because I mean I was impressed when I first met him playing on the team. I was like, yeah. Who, who's this guy? I was like, he's pretty good. I've noticed there's a lot of players that have taken breaks and they're starting to pop back. Mm -hmm. I mean, some of them took a break during COVID. Yeah, and just like to say, so you know what? Mm -hmm. I was able not to. Lit, you know, I was enjoying it and not mm -hmm. playing pool, so let me live life. Yeah, exactly. And now they're starting to work their way back. But there's players from previous, before that, yeah, exactly. it's starting to come back. Because mm -hmm. I'm like, okay, who are you? Yeah, exactly. Like, like Mo. Yeah. I, like, I never knew Mo until I think it was uh, ACS State last year. He played with my team that I'm on right now. Yeah. And uh, I played with the team that we just beat. Um and I was like, wow, like, who is this guy? He plays, yeah. he plays fantastic. See, like, we didn't know who he was until yesterday. Oh, and, really? And Eric was like, well, y'all don't know his day. He does this. It's like, from what we heard in the chat, mm -hmm. he doesn't play very many tournaments. No, he doesn't. And we stream more tournaments than anything else. Yeah, exactly. No, he doesn't really play too many tournaments. Uh, he, he's he got a couple of, uh, young kids at the house. So, oh, he, okay. uh, yeah, he doesn't go out very often. But, I mean, like I said, the, the guy just plays phenomenal. It's like. Wow, I was very impressed with him at state. I was like, "Wow, how do I not know this guy?" Yeah. Where is my baby? Hold my beer took a while to win their match. That was a that was a really good nice shot. shot. Nice, nice slow roll. Oh, that's his ball. I thought it was on eight ball. I didn't even know that was his ball. Got that. All right, cool. That was a good shot. Yeah, and uh, when I was playing in my, our last match, um, I was I was struggling really bad. Yeah. And uh, Neil comes up and he's like, "Hey, man, you're jumping up on a lot of your shots." I was like, "I am. Okay. Well, I didn't realize that." And then after after he told me that, I stayed down on my shot and mm -hmm. I started shooting a, a, a lot better. Yeah. I, was, I wasn't making those little mistakes. You, you someone told you what it was. Yes. Uh, Okay, so two zero, nemesis, our nemesis, and race to thirteen. Let's see what we got. Hey guys, uh, I know there's a lot of people watching right now that haven't hit that like button. Go ahead and hit the like button. Please yes. help out the channel. Yes, please. It does help. All right, so we got Neil against Brian on table one.
What, two weeks? Uh, July 9th. Oh, like a week yeah. from now? Yeah, it literally starts right yeah, back yeah, up. Yeah, literally a week from now. Because y'all finished up, and then it was a couple of weeks before this, right? Y'all had an off week? Yeah, I think we had one week off, and then that was it. Yeah. So, Well, uh, I didn't get qualified for the last one, so. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's when I was working out of town a lot. I really wanted to, though. But it's a very tough league. I mean, yeah, there's a lot the, of top shooters. The, the, in this the, there is no guarantee to win any game in in this league. There's just so many good players. Yeah, and, and, and players do bounce around. They do a lot. Yeah, and, and the, but that's the thing though is a lot of these players, like, they're not all in stacked teams. Right. So yeah, you're gonna have one or two good players on one team. I mean, there are gonna be stacked teams. Don't get me wrong, yeah. but but they are very beatable. Yeah, I mean, even, you know, I I think Hammerheads, mm-hmm. they got some really strong players, but they don't have any really overly no. strong. No. They're just solid as a team. Yes, exactly. And I, I, oh, I, I don't think I can say anything. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not on me to say anything. But, yeah. Um, but like 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 five man, five man, they all of them are strong shooters. Yeah. No. And and they uh the team that we just uh we just won against they beat them thirteen to twelve last night man yeah and they had a full roster yeah and they had a full and, roster see and that team was shooting short all day long yeah they 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 only, they only had the four and they they their last match showed up on their last match at the beginning of the match and I mean it helped out a lot but they still they were still uh they kind of already had it in their heads yeah. Because they had already lost on the winner side, which they they lost badly. Yeah, but they were shorthanded, yeah. and it was a strong team. It's like yeah. I think the last time we played these guys. Uh, it was a pretty tough match. Uh, I think the score was like thirteen to nine. I yeah, think. and they, they they kept up up with us the whole entire time, and we just kind of ran ran with it at the end. But, but yeah, it, that definitely a tough team. <clears throat> You should be up after these two, right? Um, or the next one? I think it's uh, Are you fit? Are you it, fit? is is Neil playing? Yes. Okay, then yeah, I'm on the next table. Yeah, because it's already two zero, and yeah. you got two tables. Down, yeah. So. Yeah. So if Tim wins his game over there, then I get to play on the other table. Uh, it, this is Tuesday nights, Jacob. Hey, yeah. Jaden, how you doing? Uh, every Tuesday night, uh, it's an in-house league, so there's no traveling at all. Yeah, it's just embassy. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's a race of 13. You play on two tables. It goes by really quick. We're usually done by, like, 9 o'clock, and we get, we get started at 7.30. So, I mean, I like it because I got to get up early in the morning for work. So, I, yeah. I come play my games, I leave, and I'm at home by 10 o'clock. So, What are you looking to do on table two? I don't know. Is he trying to play a safe? I don't know. Is that a solid in the corner pocket right there closest to us? I think it's a solid. I think it is, yeah. So I think he only has the one ball. So he's going to either try to bank it or kick at it into the corner. But that side pocket for the scratch That's is exactly. right there. So if he, if he tries to bank that ball, he has a good chance of scratching. But if he kicks at it, I mean, I don't know if he can actually like kick it into the corner. but. Uh, but even if he does that, he has a good chance of hooking himself or uh, leaving himself a hard, really hard cut. Good shot, Neil. Good shot. 
You still got a lot of work to do on no, that yeah, table. No, that's that's ugly, ugly. that's an ugly table. I noticed a lot of breaks have been shifting a lot of balls to the left. Well, a lot of them have been doing the second ball break. And the second oh, okay. ball break is just notorious been, for oh, that, yeah. Well, I'm especially here. I, I, every every single time I've seen someone do a second ball break, it's always clustered like this. Okay. Uh, and and my mentality is break them head on, and if I don't make a ball, I lose. So, right. but but if if I make a ball, then I have a good chance of getting out, and there's no clusters. Well, I went to the second ball with V and EA. Yes. Because I when I went to Vegas, everybody was doing the second mm-hmm. ball break thing. I never did a second ball break. Yeah, well, I mean, I, but I, all, I every hate. team, every team mm-hmm. we were playing is like second ball. So I started doing it, which I did it in APA. Oh wow, did he, he make that? Wow, wow, he made that ball. Okay, we got, wow. the, re- we got the replay here. I was gonna say I didn't even see it. Let me see. Did he kick at that ball? I'm looking. Oh, he kicked at the oh, ball. He wow, it. good, nice. great shot, great shot. Okay, we need to write that one down. All right, well, I'm going to go get ready for my game. Okay. Who can guess? Hmm? Okay, with that on the back table, hold my beer, got on the board. Oh, Rick bought it for you? Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, that was Roger that just broke on table two. Dry break. Ooh, three ball combo by Neil there. So how is everybody today? When was the last time y'all played pool? I'll have to get up and walk around here in a few minutes. All right, so Jaden played yesterday. Yeah. 
You know, went for the bank. Ryan's trying to figure out how he wants to do this. I don't know if he can cut that ball on the side. I think it's the 15. He's calling it. Still kick into it, looks like. I don't know, you hit the combo. Get a good leave off of it. You play the two way shot. I missed the second table. He got it. Okay, hold my beer. Got table two. So they tied it up 2 2. He's a good shot. Everybody, I'll be right back.
All right, everybody. Uh, if you're just now joining us, this is the fourth place match. We're down to four teams. We are running a little bit behind the schedule. Scheduled schedule. This match was supposed to start at two. It started at two forty-five. Uh, next round was supposed to start at four thirty. But it'll probably be running a little bit behind unless one of the teams just take off, which did happen in, yesterday on a couple of rounds. Team got momentum and just continued to roll. All right, that's a nice spread on that table. Got a little bit of work. He is walking it through. Yeah, he's going to start with the bottom end over here. Hit that point. Get that seven ball. He's got the one. Hey everyone, I'll be right back. I'm going to need to stand up.
Hey everyone, uh, Lisa gave me the rest of her plate uh, basket, so I was eating it. I do apologize. Okay, Malcolm's got a lot of work here to run this back out on table one. <laughs> but he can make it happen. Commentator curse. Commentator curse. All right, so hold my beer. You know, I may be a game off. Yeah, it's 4-3 Nemesis. They, uh, while I was eating, I missed a game. Hey, I do want to thank everyone for joining us today on the Backwards Billiards YouTube channel. Thank you. Do mini rod or Hey, John, how you doing? Glad you could join us today. I don't know. Brown Skinny Bob's is the only place that I've known that's had it. Oh, they've had it for a long time. That's all I drink up there. Yeah, this is good. Okay, he's going to sneak this around. There he goes. Do it very nicely. I think he drew it a little bit further than he wanted, but he'll be able to make up for this. Uh, doing good, John. Just live streaming, just relaxing, having some fun, letting the guys play their match. Yeah, this is the fourth place match, so it is a race to 13.
the 17th through the 21st. Those are what it was this year. So 25 days. Very nice. Huh? Baby, could you order me the egg rolls, please? Uh, so, uh the Philly cheesesteak, if they got them. I can't remember if, they, if they're Southwest here or they're Philly cheesesteak. I don't remember. If not, give me a regular. Yeah, I ate the rest of her basket, everyone, so it wasn't a full basket. I need more food. Hey, Alex. Oh, is it going to block the pocket? Nope, it's still open. Hey everyone, I wanna we've got several new members that have joined our Eclectic Soul family. Welcome. We're now at eleven thousand nine hundred and twenty two. Thank you all for being part of our Eclectic Soul family. We really do appreciate it. Okay, hold my beer, ties it up to table one. Short 4-4, four, four, race to 13. Got Roger coming on table one against Eric. And we got Tim on table two right now, and he's shooting against Brian. Yeah, Eric's going to go get his break cue. Tim shooting in the side real quick. Nice. Kept it simple. He is against the rail, but he does have a shot on the five ball. And if he rolls it up a little bit, he'll take the eight ball in the top left. Okay, and on table one, we got Eric getting ready to break. Huh? 
Yeah, the Philly. Okay. Hmm. You could have ordered, if you wanted some, you could have ordered pork. Oh, okay. Yes, Eric broke that mess. He racked it. He racked it. He broke it. Oh, okay. He didn't get behind the point. He's like right on the point. Hi, baby. Hi. What you doing? <laughs> Twiddling my thumbs. You weren't twiddling your thumbs. You went and ordered me food. Maybe. Which I think you. I'll make chocolate peanut butter cups. Okay. Ten dozen of those. Two dozen of those. You gotta make your banana ones. Banana. I got the ones. banana, the straw. Two dozen banana, two dozen strawberry, two dozen cho German chocolate, two dozen cookies and cream, and then I'll make two dozen. Uh, what did I just tell you? Chocolate peanut butter. Okay. Nice tight shot that shot there from Brian on table two. He will have to do a little bit of cue ball movement to get position on that eight, a better position. Oh, he came back. He's got an angle, but it's not a great one. Yeah, it's a chocolate cupcake with peanut butter frosting. But then the middle of it, you can put, stuff it with whatever. Yeah. Okay, so Brian took a game on table two, which means hold my beer moves up five four. Mini peanut butter cups. You can put it in the middle of those. Okay. Or Reese's minis. When they bite out of them, mm. they fall out. <laughs> yeah. No, better not do that. They don't make a mess. We could do the peanut butter cup. I don't know. There's Larry. Hmm? There's Larry. Can you see that six ball? Yeah, he can. Is that the six ball? I can't even tell. Yeah, I know. It's kind of hard. I think it's a two. Maybe it's a six. You know, it's two ball. Okay. The, the lighting in here gets me with certain colors. I'm just old and can't see. But we're also not zoomed in on one table like we normally are. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Nice shot. Nice shot. Uh, he's got a little bit of an angle. He's got that. a lot of bit of an angle, depending on the pocket he's going to. Yeah, well, if, he's, if he called that top right one, he's going to worry about that side pocket on the stretch. Yep, he's looking at it now. I think if he would have made it, he would have scratched. Yeah. I would have put bottom. Bottom and tried to pull it. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't a lot of it wasn't a lot of ball to ball contact, but it would have pulled it some for sure. I still would have put bottom on it to try to pull it out because that scratch was right there. But then that's just me, and I'm kind of stupid that way. But. <laughs> No, you're not. Okay, Roger's at the table now. Come on, boo. Oh, he's just going to play safe. Nice shot. There's a kick here. There's two kicks here. See, I'd go to the top foot row and come back with it. Yep, that's where I thought he'd go. Oh. Is he going for two rail? Mm -mm. He's going to go short rail to the bottom right. Or long rail, whichever you want to call it. Making a V. Uh, Ooh. Moved ball and ended up scratching. Roger's going to have ball in hand. Nope. Why not? It's Kansas. Exactly. <laughs> nope. It's one of my favorite songs. Like a big bounce. Gonna draw this one. Just a little. Thank you. He yeah, not much. Oh, they didn't cut him in half. Oh. Okay. Right here, eat what you need. Well, to... those aren't the big. No, just eat it because it's too hot right now. Okay, so Roger got that one. That ties it back up five five. Yeah, he did. He got out of line the first shot. I wanted to draw back 
Hey, everyone. <laughs> I got food just showed up. I'm going to go ahead and eat. I'll be right back. Napkins are underneath there. What? Excuse me, people. No kidding, fool. This looks like a nice table. I don't see any problem people over there. No problem clusters. I think I need to get me some caffeine.
Hey everyone, I am almost finished eating. Uh, give me a little bit longer and then I'll be back with y'all.
Hey everyone. If you're ever at Fast Eddie's Embassy Oaks, I highly recommend the Philly Cheesesteak Egg Roll. Really good. Alright, so our nemesis is up 9 6. We are starting to get crowded in here. They've got a 3 o'clock APA league that does play up front. We've got a lot of regulars starting to get around, so it's going to. See, they should not have put anyone on that table right there. On 23. They're not regular. They're not regular pool players. You hear me? Table 23 should not have anyone on it. Yeah, but they put them on it, so. Yeah, because they're not regular pool players. They're just standing around. They're shooting, but they're standing around in the middle at times. Both of them at the table. Oh, we lost a cue ball. Hey, everyone. Thank you all for joining us. We really do appreciate it. Day two of the SAACS slash BCAPL League. It's an in-house league here at Fast Eddie's Embassy Oaks on Tuesday nights. Nice combo there from Brian. <clears throat>
Hey, Pool Hub, what's up? You're doing good, man. Doing good. Hey, you keep up doing your thing. For sure. They're trying to get tables situated. That's what you can see Lisa back there with the bartender. Hey everyone, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. All right, yeah, unfortunately that ball fell. His corner ball. So it looks like jump cue came out. He doesn't have to jump a full ball. But it is some good distance. It's a good seven feet from each other. The shot, you get the bump. Oh, do it again. Do it again. Okay. Bumped it out there on table two. <clears throat> He's chalking up the jump cue again for table one. He's calling the bottom left. Oh, he scratches.
All right. Sorry, one of my allergies are still bugging me. Okay, so Brian's just going to pop it back a little bit. Boy, his draw caught on. Oh, oh my God. He just forfeited the game. Yeah, go shake his hand. That draw caught. Okay, so nemes our nemesis. Yeah, once he put it on the table and it hit one of the other balls, that was automatic loss again. Yeah, automatic loss. That's one of the bad things about grabbing it. You know, they say just let it fall. Because if you bump it and it actually hits a ball, it, it can actually be a loss of game. Okay, so we got Mickey on that one. So that's our our nemesis is at eleven. This is little Bobby racking on table one. He's with hold my beer. Yeah, <clears throat> that is uh, something Bobby does all the time. Uh, no matter what table he's on, he does it every time. That's his racking routine. <clears throat> Okay, so all right, good break. <clears throat> good break on table two. Yeah, pull hub, we're getting there. Um, where are we right now? I think we're at 923. Yeah, 11,923 now. We gained a couple of new ones just a little while ago. <clears throat> but yeah, we just keep doing, but thank you. We just keep doing what we're doing. I look at it this way, either they, li they like us or they hate us. <laughs> and we'll get enough likes. Ones that like us. Okay, he's going to cross bank this. Oh, nice try, Bobby.
<laughs> Thank you, man. Thank you. But I'll be honest, I got my fair share of haters. But I've gotten to the point where, hey, if they don't have my cell phone number, I ain't worried about them. Nice bump out by that. Gave himself a shot. On table two. Don't play safe. On table one. Uh, Bobby does have some shots. I mean, he's not a great make the ball, but he can definitely make contact with his and try another safe back. Okay, so hold my beer wins that game, so they're up to seven now. Hey everyone, I'm take my headset off. I'll be back.
All right, everybody. I am back. Well, on table two, they ended up making the eight. Uh, eight does not count on a snap as a win. So the breaker has an option of spotting it and continue shooting or re-racking and re-breaking. Oh, nice try on table one. And that is, on table two, that is Eric. He is the league operator for this league. And he's playing Mickey. Oh, he popped that through there. Hey everyone, if y'all could hit that thumbs up, we'd really appreciate it. It does help us out with the YouTube algorithm, and the algorithm controls what gets shared on the main pages of YouTube. Basically, they're recommendations and suggestions. Nice shot. Now, I'm not sure he can see enough of the three ball to take it down the rail. Oh, and Eric on table two. Good cut, just didn't go in. Okay, so table two, this is Mickey coming to the table now. Oh, he shot the one ball on table. I wasn't sure if it would go by, but hey, nice try. Oh. Uh. The other team that lost the hot seat last night, they are here now, so they're warming up. They'll be playing the winner of this match. Hey, Monique, welcome back. We're doing good. We are almost done. Well, we're getting close to being done with the fourth place match. Eric's looking at table two. It, it's it's ugly. We'll just leave it at ugly. It's going to be a strategic game on that one for sure. A lot of safety play. <laughs> Monique livens up the chat for sure, James. Oh, not what Eric wanted. Oh, and he rattles the ball over here. Wow.
Thank you so much, Monique. Oh, look at this. Look at this shot on table one. Very nice. So, Monique, what'd you eat? Or have you eaten dinner yet? Ooh, you just popped it over. That scared me a little bit. Oh, he misses it. Oh, my God. That was for the match. Oh, you had, okay, you haven't eaten yet, cleaning, oh, a giant house centipede, oh. Okay, so hold my beer goes to nine. Our nemesis is on the hill. Okay. Try to get the break out. Eric just missed it on table two.
Okay, Eric's going to shoot this and try to get the breakout again. Nope, he decided to play safe. Hey, Marty, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Ah, it's rainy there. Yeah, we're nice, hot, and sunny. It's like 100 degrees outside. Oh, oh, he missed that. He hit the point. All right, this is a great opportunity on table one. Uh, Mickey is still shooting on table two. Yeah, but we're doing good here, Marty. Uh, the rain's starting there. Yeah. And we're not supposed to see rain anytime soon. Okay, Mickey played a safe on table two against Eric. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, it looks like Eric's, Eric is stretching for it on table two. Is he going to scratch? No, they're not acting like he scratched. Nope, he didn't make it to pocket. So Mickey's going to have a work things out here. Our nemesis is on the hill. Hold my beer has been making a slow comeback, slow and steady.
for the safe. He called a pocket, but he's more of a safe. Oh, it stayed in the pocket. He got position for the six. Oh, if you're in your rainy season. Oh, okay. Yeah, we won't. Oh, well, I'd say our rainy season is about two months away. It just depends. I know there's another hurricane that formed way out there on the other side of the Caribbean islands. Depends on if it heads our way or not. But that's still, you know, week plus away. You still get to the pool room then. <laughs> Good. You don't want to miss playing pool. As long as your pool tables aren't outside, you're good. Okay, he's getting positioned for the one ball here. He'll need to draw back for the six. And it just depends on where he ends up, how he's going to handle that eight ball right there by the six. Dun, dun, dun. He rolled it. He's got a good angle on it. He can pop off. Come to the right just a little bit. Get off that ball. Get off the ball. Okay, he's got a good shot here. All right, with that one, our nemesis takes the match. Uh, they will be playing who's Misfits. Okay. Let me get the scoreboard fixed. Misfits is here.